Welcome to another edition of the Technology Department's Tech Bytes, where we take big tech ideas and break them down into bite-sized chunks. Today, we're going to look at some basic Chromebook navigation. I'm on a Chromebook now, and to get to the apps in the Chromebook, click the circle in the bottom left corner that says Launcher. You'll see a list of apps here that you have used recently, but if you click this up arrow, you'll see your full list of apps. Additionally, if you scroll with your trackpad up or down or your mouse or click the dots over on the right, you see I have many different pages of apps also. Don't forget to scroll to the very bottom if you're looking for one. Now, if I have one here that I want to move somewhere else, I'm going to click and hold it. And then using my trackpad, I'm going to move it up to a different page. And now I've reorganized the apps. On top of that, I can take this app and put it on top of another and make myself a folder to be even more organized and I can rename it. Also on your Chromebook, in the bottom right corner where the clock is, if I click here, you notice I have a lot of options in here. I can change the screen brightness, the volume, which I can also do with the keyboard shortcuts on the keyboard too. I can turn Bluetooth on and off, the Wi-Fi on and off, most importantly, though, here is the settings button. And here is all of my different Chromebook settings. I can scroll through. I can do work on displays. One thing to note in displays is you can turn on nightlight, which would, in the evening, turn the screen a little more warm. So it's easier on your eyes to use your Chromebook at night. Nice little tip there. Also, while I'm in here, if I scroll farther down and I go to advanced, Roll a little bit more. There's a spot for printers if you have one. And also, here's my Bluetooth option and Wi-Fi option. Also in that same panel in the bottom right corner, this is where I can power off the Chromebook or I can sign out if I need to add other users or sign in as a student. Very handy to know where these buttons are in your Chromebook. Bottom left is your apps, don't forget to scroll. And on the bottom right, you have these. Oh, while we're here, if I have an app that I use all the time, let's say I use Google Meet all the time. If I two finger click it or right click if you have a mouse and pin to shelf, now it stays down here permanently. I can do that for any of my apps. And if I don't want to pin it to the shelf, I can unpin it, two finger click and unpin. And also in the apps, if I have something I'm not using, I can two finger click it and uninstall it from your Chromebook. Thanks for watching.